How to restrict children from playing games on smartphones. It's no secret that children love smartphones. They're fun, they're interactive, and they offer a whole world of games and apps to explore. But as any parent knows, too much screen time can be a bad thing. That's why it's important to set up parental controls on your child's smartphone. In this blog post, we'll show you how to do that on both iPhone and Android devices. We'll also share some tips for managing your child's smartphone usage so that they stay healthy and balanced. The problem with children and smartphones. Smartphone addiction is a real and growing problem, especially among children. The constant access to games, social media, and other apps can be extremely addictive and lead to serious problems. Studies have shown that excessive screen time can lead to attention problems, sleep issues, anxiety, and depression. It's important to be aware of the dangers of smartphone addiction and take steps to prevent it. The negative impact of too much screen time. Too much screen time can have a negative impact on children in many ways. It can lead to poor grades, behavioral problems, social isolation, and even health issues like obesity and poor sleep habits. It's important to limit your child's screen time and encourage them to engage in other activities as well. How to set up parental controls on smartphones. Parental controls can be extremely beneficial in helping to manage your child's smartphone usage. By setting up parental controls, you can help to limit the amount of time your child spends on their phone, as well as the types of apps and games they can access. This can ultimately help to reduce the risk of smartphone addiction and other negative effects associated with too much screen time. There are a number of different ways to set up parental controls on smartphones. iPhone users can take advantage of the screen time feature, which allows parents to set limits on app usage, as well as restrict certain types of content. Android users can use the Google Family Link app to set similar limits on their child's phone usage. How to set up parental controls on iPhones To set up parental controls on an iPhone, open the Settings app and tap on Screen Time. From here, you will be able to set daily time limits for specific apps, as well as restrict access to certain types of content, explicit music or videos, you will also need to create a four-digit passcode that will be required when making changes to these settings. How to set up parental controls on Android phones. Android users can use the Google Family Link app to set up parental controls on their child's phone. Once installed, this app will allow you to see how much time your child is spending on their phone, as well as what apps they are using most frequently. You can then set limits on app usage and content access accordingly. Tips for managing your child's smartphone usage the first step in managing your child's smartphone usage is to establish screen time limits. This will help prevent your child from becoming addicted to their phone and ensure that they are getting enough physical activity and face-to-face -face interaction. There are a few different ways you can do this.
One way is to set a daily limit for how long your child can use their phone. For example, you could allow them to use it for one hour in the morning and one hour in the evening. Another way is to set limits for specific activities. For example, you could allow them to play games for 30 minutes but only after they have completed their homework. You can also use parental controls to restrict access to certain apps or websites. For example, you could block all gaming apps so that your child can only use their phone for homework or communication purposes. Encouraging alternative activities. In addition to setting screen time limits, it is also important to encourage your child to participate in other activities. This will help them stay balanced and avoid becoming too reliant on their phone. Some ideas for alternative activities include Encourage them to read books or magazines instead of spending all their free time on social media or playing games. Get them involved in extracurricular activities like sports, music, or art classes. Plan family outings and vacations that don't revolve around screens, go hiking, yes. explore a new city, visit a museum, etc. Monitoring your child's smartphone usage. It is also important to keep an eye on how much time your child spends on their phone overall, as well as what they are doing while they are using it. There are a few different ways you can do this. Checking in with them regularly. Ask them about what apps they're using and what they're doing on them. Using parental controls, these can give you insights into how much time your child is spending on their phone as well as what kinds of things they're doing. Installing a usage tracker, this can give you detailed information about your child's phone usage, including how long they're using specific apps and when they're using them. Monitoring your child's smartphone usage will help you ensure that they are using it responsibly and not becoming addicted. Conclusion The best way to protect your children from the dangers of smartphone addiction is to set up parental controls and establish screen time limits. By monitoring their usage and encouraging alternative activities, you can help them stay healthy and balanced.